A beach volleyball competition which started on Saturday last week for both the under-15s and under-18 men's and women's teams will be used to identify two potential players for the under-18 men's team which goes into training once selections are done for the youth games. For the mini Pacific Games and similar competitions will also run alongside the junior competitions so that two senior men and two women's team can be selected. At the end of the year is the mini games in Vanuatu for the, and also beach volleyball is part of that, uh, that uh, mini games. Our men's volleyball team, the gold medal winners will be our, our focus uh, for, the, for the mini games. But basically right now we are looking at uh, under 18. He says in order for Papua New Guinea to qualify for the 2018 Gold Coast Commonwealth Games, teams will have to attend qualifiers both regionally and internationally. But above all, he said full attention will go towards the under-18 men's team in making sure that competitions and training programs are attended by selected candidates and that a proper training regime is put in place to give them the full support they require in order to attend the youth games in the Bahamas in July. July. The focus is basically on under-18 uh, boys this year because in July uh, our boys team will be joining the rest of the other sports that have been identified to take part in the uh, youth commonwealth games in Bahamas in the, in, in the Caribbean. And the Corporate competitions for beach volleyball will also be introduced so that the code can be exposed to boost the interest and popularity of the sport in the country. Uh, we, we wanted to include the under-15 competition because over time these young boys and girls will be able to rise up to, the, to that stage when they reach uh, 18. The code of beach volleyball is also on the list of games to be played at this year's PNG Games in Kimbe. Godwin Eki, National MTV Sports.